guys today's video is going to be a custom video on these nike air penny twos we are going to be doing a blue bape camo but first we're just going to give them a quick wash and i have a small unboxing for you in a little bit showing you what colors i did end up purchasing but let's just go straight into the video plug your headphones in and enjoy the music so we're just going to get straight into the package of what I ordered. We're not going to show the whole unboxing, the whole stickers, the oh my god it comes with this, blah blah blah. So we're just going to get straight into it as soon as I can freaking open the package. I didn't realize how long it took me, but give me a minute. Still going. Alright, so now we got the first product out, and it is the airbrush cleaner, because my airbrush has been clogged. Um, it's the newer product that they just released. I got the pale blue paint from Angelus to also mix some of my colors for the Bape camo, and we got the light blue, another blue to mix colors with for this Bape camo that we are going to be doing today. And you know, my idiot child self just had to pop the bubbles. Anyways, let's get straight into the video. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to spend time taping the shoe off on any areas that we don't want the paint to touch. It is going to be crucial that you do this first step or else you will probably most likely mess up if you are a beginner. Um, I did that mistake a lot, especially with customer shoes, and it's not that good to do it with your customer shoes at that. So we're just going to take our time. Taping is the longest, it's the most boring. Now we're gonna get straight into the actual custom part. So I can try some, I thought taking drugs just ain't true for you, for you. 